Kensington Primary remaining true to form has maintained a high standard in the grade 4 numeracy test administered by the Ministry of Education. For the academic year 2010-2011, the institution achieved 91% mastery in the examination. The grade 4 numeracy test consists of three subtests of skills. They are number operation and representation, measurement and geometry, and algebra and statistics. The overall performance of a child on this test is expressed in either mastery, meaning the child has mastered the three skills and is considered numerate, almost mastery, meaning the child has mastered one or two of the three skills and is close to being numerate, and non-mastery, meaning the child has not mastered any of the three skills and is considered non-numerate. For grade four this year, we had a 100% in literacy and we had 91.8% in numeracy. The Ministry of called that a 91% numeracy. We were given a target for the literacy. We were 96% last year and we were asked to put on 2%. So we're focusing on moving back to 99 because we are 99 the year before. However, we have moved up to 100%. However, we are a little disappointed in the math in that we were 94% last year and we fell by basically 3% this year. So there are some disappointment there. We are going back to the joint board to see what went wrong. We are presently analyzing the data and to see what's the new way to go. First, you have to hold people accountable. Teachers are held accountable at Kensington. And you have to motivate the children. And you have to look at your teaching strategies. It is said that we cream, but if you get a cream at grade one and you don't start eating that free ice cream, you will not have the success we have at grade four. At grade one, you have to start the program from grade one. We look at those children who are weak, we have pull-outs for reading room, and the teachers use a lot of music. actually start from grade one, two, three, coming up right to grade four. So at grade four, we will just put the icing on the cake um, by getting them ready for the grade four exam. It's actually a process that takes great dedication and commitment on the part of the teacher. It's a lot of early morning, a lot of late evenings, and with the parental support, we were able to have achieved the results that we got in, in the sitting. Well, for the future, it's one of the, the, the aims here at Kensington. It's a part of our vision and mission statement that we want to produce children who are 100% literate and numerate, you know, become functionable in society, that they're able to go out there and to, to make their mark. So for the future, we're hoping that we can actually get everybody 100% turning them out into high school, both literate and numerate. It was nerve-wracking. I couldn't think straight, but when I got the paper, I remembered everything. It, I, um, it, I was very nervous, I was even shaking, but God, God um, brought me through, and the grade 4 teachers, they worked very hard with us. Miss Wilson made us do extra lessons even when we didn't pay, and we got to, um, they taught us songs and we remembered them so it helps us it helped us in the grade for the charity exam and numeracy. I have to study every day and my teacher Miss Nelson she always teach us stuff and at Brenda says she let us do extra for free. 
we did a lot of stuff, we worked very hard. It was unexpected.